Hello friends, my name is Namita Dimri and today we are going to learn about foreign key. First of all, we all know the importance of a properly designed database. It provides with up-to-date and accurate information. Let's take an example of student database. As you can see here, I have placed all the information of students, course and instructor in one single table which is not a good idea because it will lead to wastage of space which will further cause uh, errors and inconsistencies. Hence, we divide our information into various tables, for example, student table, course table and instructor table. And each table has a primary key that uniquely identifies each record. For example, here, in the student table, SID is the primary key. Why? Because it uniquely identifies each record. Say for example, Naman has SID 1. No other student can have one SID. It will always be unique for Naman. Similarly, in the course table, CID is the primary key. No two courses can share same course ID. And in the instructor table, IID is the primary key. No two instructors can have similar IID. After we divide the information into various tables and ascertain the primary key, comes linking into the picture. That is the relationship between the tables. And how do we create that relationship between two tables? We create a common column between the tables which is called as foreign key. So here between the student table and the course table, we create a common column that is course ID in the student table so that we can know in which course the student is registered. So here we can see that Naman is registered in the course C1 and using the C1, we can see in the course table the data of C1 that is the course and the instructor ID. Similarly, using the common column of IID between the course table and the instructor table, we can further know the instructor details. So here in the student table, course ID is the foreign key and in the course table, IID is the foreign key. Also, foreign key can have repetitive values. Say for example, Naman has taken course C1, so has Nitya. She also has taken course C1. So we can see here that the foreign key can repeat itself. It can take repetitive values. So this is how the foreign key helps in linking the information and retrieving the information. It basically creates a relationship between the two tables. And foreign key always refers to the primary key in another table. Let's take another example, the director play database. Here we have two tables, director table and the play table. In the director table, director number is the primary key, whereas in the play table, play number is the primary key. Here also, we have created a common column that is director number to know the director of each play. Say for example, play number 1001, cat on a cold bare roof is directed by director number 102. So using this 102, we can see the details of the director in the director table. So here, director number is your foreign key. That's all from my side guys. Thank you so much for watching. Do like the video and hit the subscribe button to never miss a video from Ivy Professional School.